Okay, I think this is gonna be nice. <laughs> Hello and welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video of me dyeing my hair. So today I'm gonna dye my hair a color that's a little bit out of my comfort zone and that is brown. I am going brunette. So we're using the Overtone Espresso Brown. And I know you might be thinking, what? Brown, being a brunette is out of your comfort zone when you've basically done every color in the rainbow. I know, but something about a dark brown, especially, this is like the darkest I've ever dyed my hair. I don't know, I get scared. I feel like it's gonna be too dark. It might like wash me out. I don't know, I'm like tripped, but I'm also super, super excited to do this because my hair is, it is not it, sis, it, I don't know. When, I feel like my hair is super ugly right now just because it's like yellow and my roots are growing out. So I want it to be all one color as much as I can. So that's why I want to do like the, the darker brown. So hopefully it can like even this all out. And I don't know if you guys watch Jordan Lipscomb, but she did her hair dark and short. And I'm also gonna cut my hair too. And in her video, she was like, everyone should go dark and short once in their life. And I'm like, yo, it's my time. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna go dark brown and cut my hair short, a little shorter. It's already short, but you know what I mean? So if you wanna see me do that, then keep on watching. All right, I got my gloves on and these are like more heavy duty gloves because the last time when I did the overtone ginger, the color went through the gloves and stained my fingernails. So hopefully that will not happen this time because I'm in lockdown now and I can't go to the nail salon. So you guys know the drill. This smells the same as all the overtone um, hair colors do, that like minty smell. It looks like this. Look how dark it is. I feel like, okay, because I did do a test strand on one of my wigs because I thought I was going to do this on a wig and then I'm going to do it on my hair. But it kind of like it low key came out like black like a brown black so I don't know it's gonna come out so dark I'm shook and if you've watched my other videos this is my third time using overtone and I really love their colors they come out really nice and they make your like their color conditioners make your hair feel so soft and silky it's yeah they're great so oh my god okay I'm so nervous Okay, okay. I think this is gonna be, I think it's gonna be okay. The only other concern I have is the fade out with like the yellow, cause I don't know, like, you know what I mean? Like if it fades out differently on the yellow as opposed to my natural hair color, how that's gonna look. But I feel like it's gonna look okay. Like it won't be like that much of a weird difference. Okay, I think this is gonna be nice. Okay, okay. Let's get into it. Red eyes, strobe lights moving across the walls. You're looking like a movie star, but I don't know just what you are. Seems like you're top to be on the floor. You're looking for a kind of queen, the baddest one you've ever seen. You're shining bright as crystal, moving like a twister. Ooh, I'm swaying to the hips, boy, loving every disco. Ooh, so you say you're loving somebody else, that I am only for tonight. Yeah, you say you're gone and still you're in my bed. You're loving how I read your mind. So you say. So you say, say, so I play, play, I don't love you anyway. 
obsession. What do you guys think? I am obsessed. I love it. This is exactly what I wanted. Okay, when I was cutting my hair, I was like, ah, did I cut it too short? I did want to go like pretty short short, so I am happy with this length. This is pretty much going to be kind of the last time I cut my hair, and then I'm going to start growing out my hair, and I'm pretty much almost grown out most of the bleachy spots. You can't really see it now because my hair is all one color, which I'm so excited about, but you can see my natural hair is kind of like more of like a warmer chocolate brown and then it gets into a darker brown on the bleach spots but you cannot see the orange through which i'm super happy about and yeah my hair's all one color which i'm so happy about and it's not yellow ah! i feel like this look makes me look more russian do you think like i'm like a russian spy you know but yeah let me know what you guys think in the comments i think this is going to be the last time i color my hair for this year. I mean, it's almost the end of the year, so that's like saying something. And I think I'm gonna start coloring some wigs instead and kind of let my hair grow out. So stay tuned for that. I do have another wig that I'm gonna color soon and it's gonna be a fun color. So stay tuned for that and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching, bye.